CTA is usually thought of as a means to get to a destination. But have you ever thought of the CTA as a destination in itself? You will, once you view the new CTA public art section on the CTA website. There are more than 50 pieces of art on exhibit at more than 40 CTA stations. People are familiar with the works of the stations they frequent. But now, much of the CTA's public art is highlighted on the CTA's website. On this website, uh, you can actually take a tour. It's a tour of museum quality artwork without leaving your home, but it's also a way to uh, map your travel throughout Chicago if you want to take an art tour. The majority of pieces featured are products of the federally funded Arts and Transit Program. Chicago's Department of Cultural Affairs oversees the selection and installation of the art. All pieces are original works. The selection process started in 2004 when we worked on the Pink Line. And what's very interesting about the CTA's art collection is that it was a community-based process. In every neighborhood, committees were assembled to select the artwork and community members had an active role in deciding what the art would look like in their neighborhood station. Some of the art pieces are functional and double as seating. Others simply offer visual comfort. The work behind me at the Sedgwick Station is by Chicago artist Design. And what's interesting about it is that it reflects the Old Town neighborhood, which is known as, as a center of the arts, and it also reflects the individual because there are broken pieces of mirror in this work. Another work that's interactive is a suspended sculpture at the Howard Station by artists Carla Arrocha and Stefan Schreinen. They are Belgian artists who created this massive suspended sculpture of mirrors that reflect the station and that reflect all of the passengers. The Brown Line alone offers art lovers an on-the-go gallery of beautiful works. On the Brown Line, there is a new work of public art in every station between Chicago and the end of the line at Kimball. For the price of a CTA ticket, you can experience a wide variety of contemporary art by both international, national, and local artists. CTA Public Art reinforces Chicago's international reputation as a museum without walls. The City of Chicago has a collection of more than 700 works of art located in public buildings throughout the city, and the CTA has now added to Chicago's incredible collection of contemporary art uh, that really offers something for everyone. The CTA Public Art website provides photos, artist information, and the artist's interpretation of their work. As beautiful as the photographs are, the work is best experienced firsthand. It's literally like visiting a museum, sitting at your own computer, and hopefully you'll be intrigued by a number of works, and that will inspire you to go visit a neighborhood other than your own and see the art at the CTA. You can also download a booklet highlighting public art on the CTA on the CTA website.